And now, KITV4 Weather. We're coming off from a beautiful weekend, though we had some showers. Still gorgeous day out there. Check out in town. This see local image shot in and Pupukea looking pretty good. We're going to be much larger today in the way of surf. In fact, a high surf warning is posted for most north. Some west facing shores this is going to last through tomorrow morning. We're looking at that swell peaking today and then it should drop off into the evening hours. But deadly rip currents, you should stay out of the water if you're amateur or inexperienced. Now, our surf news network for the big wave riders calling for favorable conditions 15 to 25 for the north. 10 to 20 for the western shores, smaller for the south and east. So maybe if you are inexperienced, that's where you can head out to. Or if you're going to stick in the country, uh, grab some photos for us. Now our large northwesterly is going to get reinforced Wednesday with another one slightly smaller. Small craft advisory continues for most Hawaiian waters with east northeasterly knots right around 20. Going into our satellite imagery, we have that disturbance, a very weak front, kind of hanging out over the Big Island this morning. But uh, we're getting some northerly winds, a cool, drier air mass and that's why there's just a little bit more bite to the air. This should last for most of the work week, weakening somewhat into next weekend as another front approaches. But in the meantime, our rain forecast showing that area of moisture sticking around the Big Island and then into the afternoon hours we fall apart and for most of the state or in fact all of the state well into Wednesday afternoon we should be high and dry. Maybe an isolated shower coming through. We should, we're talking about that front. Well here it is kind of just hanging out around the Big Island. The rest of us you can see uh, just very few broken low clouds giving us isolated showers. Hours. Again, that should continue. We're looking at a really beautiful day, partly to mostly sunny. North to northeast release in that moderate range, 10 to 20 miles per hour. 78 is where we'll top off at in Honolulu with our sundown at 621. It is going to be a gorgeous sundown ahead. Now, as far as the extended forecast, although direction in our winds change somewhat in the coming days, overall we're going to hang on to trades. They will weaken somewhat Thursday into Friday and give way to those southerly Kona winds, so that might bring some haze, but it's because of a Another very weak cold front. A little bit too early to tell how much of a rainmaker it's going to be. It shouldn't be as significant as the previous week's rain. Uh, maybe somewhat close to the weekend this past weekend. So stay posted with us on KITV.com and KITV4 News as the week progresses. We'll have more details on that. Unfortunately, it lands on the weekend. But for most of the work week, nice trade wind weather ahead.